Hello everyone, uh, welcome to another session. So in this session, I'm going to explain about the, how to create the physical year variant in SAP and how we will assign it to company code level. And before jumping into the uh, configuration, I just want to discuss about uh, what is this uh, physical year variant in SAP and uh, all those things. Uh, physical year variant uh, in SAP, it determines the financial year, uh, whether it would be calendar year or non-calendar year. Uh, generally the physical means it's a period and it can be two types in sap like a calendar year and non-calendar year calendar year is uh, jan to december and the non-calendar year is uh, april to march so generally this uh, physical year variant we will define in transaction code ob29 so let me access the transaction code here so this is the screen where we will be defining the physical year variant based on the client requirement. So by default, SAP has given uh, four four physical year variants. Those are uh, K4, uh, which is a calendar year Jan to December, and four special periods. This is a calendar year, and here we can see the for twelve uh, posting periods and four special periods. And the other second one is. Uh, which is a v3 here we can see uh, it is a april to march and same here also uh, 12 posting periods and uh, for not a special periods here this is not calendar year this is a non-calendar year so when you select this one and click on periods you will see here the physical year is starting from april april onwards it's starting and ending at march uh, this is the way to create the physical year variant here uh, it's a based on the client requirement we will uh, we will create our own likewise uh, and based on uh, weekly also we can create for four weeks one month likewise also we can create the physical year variant and then coming to the next one v6 it would be june to july v6 uh, the description has been changed here, but we can see here just select then click on periods So here if you can see The physical year is starting from July July and it's ending at June and There is a one more uh, physical year variant is there which is uh, v9 V9 so just select this one and click on periods so here if you can see the physical year will be starting with october see a physical year is starting with october and it's ending with september so in nutshell uh, we can say uh, based on the client requirement we can define our own calendar year physical calendar year in my case i am taking the example as a k4 uh, which is uh, which is Jan to December. Okay, uh, let me assign it to at a company code level. To assign this physical year variant at a company code level, we need to access the transaction code OB thirty seven. OB thirty seven here. So now, here my company codes are two zero zero nine and two zero ten. So for this two uh, at the leading ledger level, I will be assigning a K4 only. Okay, so here in this transaction OB37, we will be assigning the physical year variant at against to company code. Once we assign uh, this physical year variant, then only uh, then only system will allow us to create the then only system will uh, allow us to create the uh, posting period uh, posting periods to maintain the posting periods basically okay that's all in this section uh, thank you so much for watching my videos